<laughs> Woo, truce in the building. What's good? All right, check it out. <sighs> you poor rookies. Listen, and, and listen, let me just let me just go ahead and say it. We are in a bull market, okay? Calm down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Take a breather, throttle back, and just relax, okay? Now, when I get worried, you should get worried. I'm not worried, and this is the reason why. We are in a bull market because our recent all-time high was like 13,000, like 600. Something. I don't know, it was like 13,000 something, right? This is the recent peak that it made in this market, okay? Now, there's a few reasons why we're still in the bull market. One, if you look back at the last bull market, and yes, I know past performance doesn't promise future results or whatever the heck, but the last bull market had 30 to 40% dips. And, and, what, and if you go back in the chart and look, you will see that if you move the chart and act like you're on that day, those people didn't even know what was coming. All they saw was this big 30 to 40% drop and they thought it was over, just like today. We also are we also are currently, as I'm shooting this video, bouncing off the 200 day moving average. Now, before I continue, I'm not even saying that I'm guaranteeing that we're still in the bull market, okay? Because if we do drop below 40%, say we drop 50% from the recent all time high, I'm not talking about 20,000, okay? I'm talking about our recent all time high, our recent move. If we drop below that, then I would still cons I would say, all right, I think we're we might be still in a bear market, okay? But if we recover from this and we never go back below eight grand, we are in a bull market, period. So it's kind of funny to me to see people wigging out and they're talking about three grand. And like I said, it could drop lower. I'm not saying that because it's happening like this, it won't. What I'm saying is, it's more probable that this is how Bitcoin moves, just like it moved in the last bull market, all right? And that we probably are witnessing the last chance that we had to buy Bitcoin at 8,100. Maybe not. It might drop. And if it does, all that may, it doesn't mean that it's over. It just means that we're still in a bear market. Now, this is the reason why I don't think it's going to drop more is because where we're at in the four year cycle, we are getting extremely closer to the Bitcoin habit, okay? With that being said, for us to not be in a bull market yet would be highly unlikely due to the time frame of where we're at in Bitcoin's four year cycle, where we have the bear market, the halving, you know, the accumulation phase, you know, and then the run up to the peak, okay? That's another reason why I'm like, yo, chill. But y'all don't want to chill, dog. So go ahead, panic. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Capitulate. Do whatever you want to do. But I just bought some more Bitcoin. I actually bought some more altcoins as well. All right? And people are like, well, what if it drops? You're going to get wrecked. I'm going to buy some more. 